A sequence consists of a series of steps. A step can perform many actions such as initializing an instrument, performing a complex test or controlling the flow of execution in a sequence. A sequence file can contain one or more sequences. Sequence files can also cont contain global variables which all sequences in the sequence file can access. The sequence editor color code sequences by type such as execution entry points, configuration ent entry points, process model callback sequences, subsequences and engine callbacks. The setup main cleanup groups of the steps pane display a list of the steps in the step group. The test end executes the steps in the setup group first, the main step group second, and the cleanup step group last. The setup step group typically contains steps that initialize instruments, fixtures, or a unit under test. The main step group typically contains the bulk of the steps in a sequence including the steps that test the unit under test. The cleanup group typically contains steps that power down or restore the initial state of instruments, fixtures, or the unit under test. A sequence can have any number of parameters and local variables. Use the parameters to pass data to a sequence when you call the sequence as a subsequence. Use local variables for storing data relevant to the execution of the sequence. Storing any other data needed only in the current sequence maintaining counts or holding intermediate values. In the sequence editor, the variables pane displays all the variables and properties the selected sequence has access to at runtime. When we execute a sequence, the variables pane displays the sequence context of the sequence currently selected on the call stack pane. The sequence context contains all the variables and properties accessible in the current execution. Use the variable pane to Examine and modify the values of these variables and properties when an execution is suspended.
the sequence editor opens each sequence file in a separate sequence file window. The sequences pane, the steps pane, and the variables pane. The sequences pane lists the name, comment, and requirements for all sequences in the sequence file. Use the sequences pane to select the active sequence to display in on the steps pane to insert new sequences and to delete existing sequences from a sequence file.